expansive forests, strong winds, the rolling North Sea lashing the western coast of Denmark, and a keen eye for good craftsmanship. This is how the story of Kalasu begins. Known all over the world for reliability, credibility, and innovative technology, the story harks back to 1969 in the small town of Lem, where the young entrepreneurial Herluf Kalasu started a one-man company producing smaller machines and cylinders for the wood industry. Min tvivl er faktisk ikke på det værende tidspunkt, hvor stor en succes det her virksomhed den skulle blive. Han startede som underleverandør til nogle af byens øvrige virksomheder, men fandt ret hurtigt ud af, at han skulle selv over at lave speciale maskiner. Sammen byggede de i 1971 den første produktionssal her på Brygade i Lem, og det er den adresse, vi stadigvæk har i dag. Herlufs company expanded rapidly, and he began producing Kalasu's special machines, with his wife Alice by his side. The 70s brought new opportunities within marketing and product development for the visionary company. Machines like the laminating presses for the production of laminated wood products got bigger. Kalasu grew and expanded again. I begyndelsen af 70'erne kom olieprisen. Mine svier forældre tog udfordringen op og satte hurtigt gang i en produktion af brændesager og brændekløver. Sideløbende med det blev en palleløfter udviklet, og det var starten til vores eksport. Derfra gik de stærkt, og Kalusø udvidede fra 6 til 27 ansatte. I 1986, Kalusø invented the first hot press for the production of laminated wood products. It was a huge success, which introduced the Danish machine manufacturer to the wider European market. Jeg blev ansat i 1984 og var med til at tegne de første maskiner i hånden. Vi opfandt de limpåførelser og oplæggeanlæg, som vi stadig bygger på i dag. Over the years, Kalasu has taken great responsibility for the local community, qualifying more than 150 apprentices and teaching them good craftsmanship. In 1993, Kalasu transitioned from one generation to the next. In the meantime, Bruno married Lily, Herluf, and Alice's daughter. And in 1998, Bruno took over the whole company. The success continued, and in 1994, Kalasu produced the first and defining high-frequency press with its advanced technology, which is still used today. I de nye årtusind har Kalasu endnu mere fokus på udvikling og tilpasning af maskiner til kunders behov. Vi skifter navn til Kalasu Machinery og opererer i flere og flere lande med større og større maskinanlæg. Vi køber løbende vidensvirksomheder for at sikre os alt viden omkring HF-generatorer. Since becoming a part of the Homa Group in 2021, Kalasu is stronger than ever before. Kalasu is a world leader in designing and producing solutions for the laminated wood industry. In more than 50 years, Kalasu has delivered about 500 presses and special machines to destinations across the world. Kalasu has expanded 15 times and has more than 100 employees today some of whom have been working here for more than 30 years. Kalasu is known for innovative machines with great flexibility, high performance, and low costs. Kalasu is the world's most effective and economical high-frequency presses and can be found in production companies throughout the world. Kalasu stands ready to deliver high-quality machines that maximize the use of wood thereby supporting initiatives to create more sustainable building materials in the future with innovative technology. Even though technology has progressed tremendously over the past 50 years, Kalasu maintains the same innovative mindset and quality of craftsmanship that Herla founded in 1969. Technology develops all the time. The values are still the same. Kalasu is equipped for the future, and as a proud member of HOMAG, we are more resourceful than ever. <laughs>